Get Derrick Henry on my on my project. If you want to be known as a songwriter, you got to write the songs. I think it's right? not a songwriter. You can ex- <laughs> dude, you can executive produce and not e- know anything about music. I'm People pretty, do it all the time. Just with cash. Me wrong, but if let's say the four of us are sitting in a room and we wrote a song right now, and I said one word that made it in that song, you don't even have to I say a word. Credit, you write, You just get credit for it, right? Yes, dude. Yeah. If we wrote, if me and Ryan wrote a song right now, and y'all and two are Will here, and Taylor, and Will and Taylor. Y'all, y'all, it is Will and Taylor because y'all are in the room. You Actually, get, it's a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We don't seven. have to give them credit, though. You do because they're, they're in the room. <laughs> yeah, dude. Yeah, that's yeah, Nashville. That's I think we could argue that, that 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 half of the room doesn't need credit for the song. We could argue that. But it would be literally split. You get 25, 25, 25, yes. 25. Oh, yes. If you do it in LA, though, or New York, it's different because they would go. Hey, I'll give you 4% of mine, 25. Oh but you would get, uh, if you were in LA, they would like start arguing over like they're keeping really? tabs but get that mic closer they would argue about like who who wrote what and like how much you each deserved yeah and so like you would like all those a lot of those songs go into dispute so nobody gets paid until the dispute is settled right because some guys like well i deserve more than four percent because i moved this mic cable or something and they hold really? up every, they hold up everybody's pay in nashville so you feel long. like it's different in nashville oh, it's just pretty much just cut and dry the only thing you run into in nashville is like if you, somebody potential like if you are on top of somebody else's song you might have to give them some credit like brett eldridge when he did that uh, crazy song he had that uh CeeLo green like crazy you make me crazy and i kind of like it. he had literally like the the hook to crazy in I'm his song crazy. and so he had to give credit those writers Relax, had to give honey. credit to all the people who wrote crazy and i'm sure it wasn't like an equal split but like sometimes you have to do that but other than that like it's just we split it all down the middle here mm-hmm. yeah or, or equally yeah for so, better, so better, like that better than la oh yeah because i i mean it's just but if you wrote 95 percent of the song well, and me, Will, and Ernest had a thumb up our asses the whole time. And then we're like, that's all I'm saying. If Taylor and I were just yeah. sitting here and you guys you walked out saying? like, well, no, even it's going to be a great song. Number one song, because you've had four or five number one songs. Yeah, but I would say two things to that. I would say, you because when we wrote Heartless, I was the dude, I walked in and he started just, it fell out of him. And I just had my phone being like, no, you got to say that again, exactly like that. And you need that guy to be like, definitely need the, that guy. The editor, right? Mm-hmm. Sometimes. And then I'd also say that if it's truly like I did 95% of it and it was a huge hit, I'm not, I'm just not going to do it again. You know, like yeah, yeah. all your people be like, we got to get this crew back together. And I'll be like, no, nah. no, <laughs> no. Do You're like, no. excuse me, but the crew's technically already yeah. together. I'm here. <laughs> I'm here. I'm here. <laughs> that's what I would, that's yeah. So it, that stuff all figures itself out. Do yeah. You, do you like being a songwriter? Do you like being a performer better? Is that one of the 